Hey, what's up? My name is Brandon Fulton. I'm 31 years old. I've served in the military for about nine years now as a military mechanic. And about last year, I was able to save up enough money on a deployment to purchase a five acre lot with a double wide. So I'm gonna be giving you a tour of the property and all these projects I kinda got going on now. And uh, yeah, it'll be pretty much a vlog series of uh, my homestead and everything going on in it. I hope you guys enjoy. Let's roll the tape. All right, guys, so there's the road coming into the house. It's not a private road, but it's a road around the neighborhood. We're in North Central Florida. There's some, a little bit of red dirt out here. So here's the front yard. All right. The fence and the gate was installed by the previous landowner. He also cleared the front yard, which I would have probably done a lot less of, but it is what it is. Planning on having a uh, native plant nursery, so this area along the fence is going to be where I have uh, some plants growing. Nice big longleaf pine, over a hundred years old. Turkey oaks here are also reaching a hundred years old. They don't look like much, but I've had to cut a number of them and one that size is easily a hundred years old. All right, there's the house. You're probably wondering what that is on the roof. That's my pop-up hunting blind I built. Uh, yeah, I'll give you some more videos of that later. There's definitely going to be hunting videos and hunting uh, related topic videos. But this is just the tour, so just keep that in mind. Alright. Yep, Longley Pine. You can see why they get their name. Extremely long needles like cheerleading pom-poms. Dr. Seuss kind of looking tree. This area I pretty much raked and came and weed eated to stimulate the wire rest to flower. Over there's my shed. That's also where my SRT4 neon is. The one in my previous videos, which I'll have more videos of that of course too whole nother series yeah I walked in and asked for the cheapest double wide this is what you'll get it's my truck that's another project sort of it's a daily driver right now but yeah here's the backyard so this is a clean cut example of what Longleaf Pine Savannah looks like. Low basal area, which means big open spaces in the canopy, which allows plentiful sunlight to create a very diverse understory of grasses and flowering species. There's a chicken coop. We got about, I think we got seven chickens. But yeah, I burned all of this back in uh, late May, early June. Based off of research, that's the best time of year to burn to get the most fertile seeds. So yeah. There's the hunting blind. This is my shooting lane here. Back behind this uh, temporary fence I made out of turkey oak is a food plot, roughly quarter acre in size. There's my first box I built. I'm gonna transfer it to a different hunting spot location. Yeah, so this road here appears on the aerial photography 
in the 1960s and it runs parallel with another road here that was uh, on the maps in the 40, 1943. Uh, this is the road that was uh, on the 1940s photography. You can see I haven't burned this area yet. That'll get burned next, next year. As you can see, there's a house over here. This is a, the edge of my property back there. One thing I have to keep in mind is there are people around. As much as I like to believe I'm in the wilderness, I'm not really. Alright, so uh, we're back away from the house. It's over there, so we're moving towards the northern edge of the property. Here we got some Florida rosemary. There's a little. This one's probably close to 40 years old. That's about how live, long they live, because most of them are dying around here. Back in here is kind of like a hammock area. It's real more oaks and more dense canopy. I think this pine tree is probably over 180 years old. Somewhere around there. It's one of the biggest ones on the property. And uh, there's a bigger one over there. They're probably both 180, 200 years old. Hey guys, so that was it for today. Let me know what you thought in the comments below and hit that like button and subscribe if you want to catch all the future videos that I got planned. And trust me, there's a lot of them. Have a great day.